A restaurant has started a new promotion that could lead to free donuts for an entire day. And the concept is pretty simple. Just wear your mask to order for one straight month to the order window. ABC Action News reporter Robert Boyd shows us how golden dinosaur is trying to stay safe and stay open. Well, unfortunately, the number today is zero. Remember, the goal is 30. 30 straight days that customers wear their mask to the order window. Can I get a kombucha? Yeah. Golden Dinosaurs changed their whole business plan in response to the pandemic, eliminating all indoor access to customers and instead installing an order window so they can stay open. We take it very, very seriously. Everyone wears masks 100% of the time while they work. Owners Audrey and Brian Digman have already had to close for a week due to an employee testing positive for COVID-19. They say there's only so much their staff can do. The rest is up to their customers. It seems like every fourth or fifth person, we have to politely ask them to, can you please put your mask on? Because we're face to face with our staff. And that includes, you know, being within six feet of one another, um, asking questions, talking sometimes loudly. So the vegan eatery came up with a delicious promotion. We jokingly came up with the donut idea uh, to give away free donuts if we can go 30 days without having to ask folks to please wear a mask. They say it's a fun way to hopefully stop a serious problem. It's a less intrusive or like, uh, you know, aggressive way of uh, trying to remind people, you know, we are still in a pandemic. But unfortunately, after the first nine days, the tally has yet to reach one. I mean, who doesn't love donuts? That's like the best thing you can give away. Loyal customer Sean Christofferson says, if you care at all about our local businesses, this is a very achievable goal. A lot of people during the pandemic walking around with no masks, um, you know, and it's, you know, we got to keep everybody safe. I mean, this is all about like this community. In Gulfport, Robert Boyd, ABC Action News.